Hi. Hello. How do you do? And welcome to a glorious episode of Talking with Kitties. Glorious. 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 Mm-hmm. Because it's the last one. The last one. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Now, don't get yourself all upset about this. Don't be crying in your pancakes. I don't know why pancakes. I want pancakes. Ew. I want, I want pancakes. Okay. I don't want pancakes that have been cried in. Oh. Well, those are the only pancakes that we have right now. Oh. Because the listeners have been crying in their pancakes. I don't, I don't, I don't know why I'm talking about like that. Anyway, this is the last episode. Hello, Gizzard. But it is only the last episode of season numero uno. Which is now a thing. Which is now a thing that <laughs> we just came up with several days ago. Combination of Reddit's meltdown. Mm-hmm. Girlfriend's impending vacation. Woot. Just some plans and some thoughts we have for some changes that we want to do mm-hmm. in the not so distant future. We're just gonna we're gonna take take a bit of a break. Yeah. Take uh we're figuring about a month. About a month. About a month off. Take July off. Get some things situated. Get some things figured out. Yeah. Get our ducks in a row and quack, then quack. knock them over and then get them in another slightly different row. Yeah. And uh, then show you the ducks. Share the ducks with you. Share the ducks with you. And we may actually be able to show you said docs. Yes. Are we going to talk about what the plan is? Absolutely. All right. We've been discussing since we started, I think we've mentioned it on the podcast as well several times, that we were wondering if we should turn this into a YouTube thing as well. Like a video podcast. Yeah, like a video podcast. So we have decided that season two, we're going to switch things up a bit. We're going to come back, come back at you. On the YouTubes. Going to get in your eyeballs. Get in your eyeballs and your ear holes. Yep. All at the same time. All at the same time. But don't worry. If you don't like YouTube, you do not have to look at these mugs. No. You can still just listen on wherever you listen to our podcast. Yeah. Our plan, um, we're going to be recording video as well. But as of right now, the plan is to do both video and audio. So any place that you are already listening to the podcast, you should still be able to listen to the podcast. Yes. But if you would also like to look at us as well. And the kitties, obviously. And the kitties, hopefully. Well, that's true. They don't usually like to cooperate with anything we try to do. No. But yes, if you would like to look at us as well, we will be there. Yes. And uh, the the YouTube, I mean, we already have the YouTube made. Mm -hmm. It's set up. It sure is. It's talking with kitties. It's it's very hard to find right now because there's no content. There's no nothing. I was going to say they could search for us and Even if you search for it, you're going to have a hard time finding it. But it is available. I might put a link down in the description for this I think podcast that's a good idea. so you can get straight to it. If you'd like to follow us on that to prepare yeah. yourselves, yeah. probably post some shorts at some point. Oh yeah, I'm planning on doing, you know, do the whole videos and, you know, do the whole full length podcast and then I was talking to her last night about doing shorter videos with like sections of it that are particularly funny or amusing or mm-hmm. educational, which isn't going to happen. No, but, but in case. Shorter, yeah. sh- shorter five to ten minute videos here yeah. and there. Do some shorts here and there. We're going to we're gonna have some fun with it. Maybe TikTok. Uh, I've never posted uh, a TikTok. I've never done a TikTok. I, Maybe a TikTok. That's up to you. We'll but. see. We're not 100% sure what the content's going to be about other than, you know, our normal banter and talking to our cats yes, just so. because reddit is kind of going under so yeah we don't know we need some time to really think about if we want to be like educational if we want to be political we're not going to be political um if we want to be we don't we don't really know probably best actually saying about political and thinking about it probably the best thing to do would be just straight political and religious why i don't know it seems like a terrible idea because that's nothing that either one of us even talk about you were together. supposed to giggle oh yes ha 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 uh, yeah, that is so funny. Yeah, that's not gonna be it. We could just turn into a Kardashian podcast. No, fuck. You were supposed to giggle. No. I didn't really want to. No. Are you over it now? No. <laughs> All right, that's enough. Yeah, so we don't really know what the content is going to... Yeah, because Reddit is... Dumb. ...slowly and painfully shitting itself right now. Yeah. We use Reddit for a lot of conversation starters. Yes. So if that is not available to us, we're going to have to figure out another way for... 
we have to we have to figure out other ways to bring things in because Reddit's in, in the middle of a meltdown. We don't know what's going to be happening with mm-hmm. that. Last week, you heard the last Would You Rather game night because we went through all the cards in Would You Rather, so we don't have that. Yes. So we want to figure out what we want to do for more content. And, New, and, interesting ideas yeah, and content. Things to, we got to brainstorm a little bit. Yeah. Got to brainstorm, do some testing, set up some stuff. Yeah. Got lots yeah. of ideas rattling around in our brain holes. Lots of ideas, but we haven't actually come up with a set plan. Yet. No, just the idea. So yeah. there's going to be a lot of trial and error, testing yeah. stuff out, see what sticks. So we're taking the month off, but throw we're shit not at the wall to see actually, what yeah, we're not actually just ignoring the podcast. No, we're not taking at all. the month off to put everything into the podcast and try to figure yeah. out what's next. Yeah, it's not it's not a vacation so much. It's no. just a it's just a figuring out the next step. It's yes. time for a next step. Yeah. And the timing all kind of came together kind of perfectly cuz this will be if you include all of the game nights this will be our 24th episode. Mm-hmm. We started everything just seeing if we could get past four episodes. We're like, let's see if we do it for a month, then we'll try to do two months. Yeah. And here we are 6 months in. And we've decided that we really enjoy it. Yeah. Like this is definitely something we want to do. And I haven't discussed this with you yet, Uh but I'm thinking I kind of like this whole like six month thing and Mm, mm we're like five to six months because the next time we're going to be really busy is going to be like the week of like the the Christmas ish. Yeah, so I, I'm I thought thinking about the same too. like so we'll get on a regular schedule with mid the to end of December. Yeah, we'll kind of yeah. do that with the seasons, and then I'm sure by then we'll want to redo things and revamp things, and yeah. you know, and because we want to keep bringing new and interesting and fun content. So yeah. we want to. If anybody has any suggestions, I say something like this every time, and no one ever really gives me suggestions. Yeah, but that's a, that's one of the things about if we're if we're putting it on YouTube, there's a comment. There's section a comment right section below, that they. So. Can do it which will be nice yeah so we're looking i mean like the the initial thing video podcast obviously and then, like yes. i said with the videos and you know making the videos from the video podcast and the shorts and everything also dabbling with the idea of some live streams yeah but quite possibly i set i set up a ko-fi account you don't know about this yet but i set up a ko-fi account for talking with kitties today oh, okay so a couple of different things i set up set up the ko-fi account which we have and they have memberships built into the ko-fi account ko-fi is kind of like patreon correct kind of yes yeah, okay of, yeah but there's a membership tier. There's a single donation if you want to just give us some money. And there's a membership tier where, like, every month it'll it'll be recurring. Okay. So we can have membership tiers in there. We can start setting up memberships or something in there. We can start there. sending you a cat. Yeah, well, <laughs> no. Maybe bubs. So the first first person to sign up gets bubs. <laughs> Not really. I'm just, Not really. I'm just annoyed with <laughs> He's him right now. He's very annoyed with Oscar today. Ba-dum, 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 ba-dum. But yeah, also today, kind of exciting, interesting timing on it. Um, YouTube announced that they are basically cutting the requirements in half for community-driven funding. Okay. So before, I don't remember all the specifics before, but you needed a thousand subscribers. You needed like three videos in a certain you know, so many videos in a certain time frame and so many hours watched in a certain time frame mm-hmm. and so forth. They have cut all those requirements in half. For what? Like, what does it get you? Community if... driven. So you'll be spread so, out more? No, community driven funding. So your community can donate and have memberships. Oh, and everything. It's gotcha. all built into YouTube. Gotcha. The only th- you still have to get to like a thousand. They have the same old thousand subs, everything for like the ad revenue. OK. But from what I've seen from most of the big creators, the ad revenue, you don't make much from it in the first place. And mm-hmm. it usually does more to just drive people away because they don't want to sit through the unskippable ads. That YouTube yeah, I wouldn't want to deal with that. There's a couple options coming up of ways to help fund, help keep this going. If anybody is interested, we're, we're going to be looking into all of that, trying to see what we can do. And we genuinely really enjoy doing this. We do. We really like, enjoy doing it. We're not begging it. for your money. We're no. not begging for anything. But like if this could become a full time job for the two of us, then we would be that more would than be happy. Phenomenal. And we could come up with clever stuff. Mer- Merchandise and stuff. Mm-hmm. There's a couple of merchandise ideas too. I've been getting on your brother. I t- keep telling him, like, need a logo, need a logo, need a logo. Yeah. And he keeps, rrr, rrr, rrr. he's your brother. Yeah, I sent, I sent him the link to the YouTube page. And I was like, you know what would look really good here? He's like, what's that? A logo. He's like, ugh. <laughs> I sent him a link to the Ko fi. He's like, I would look good here. And he's like, what's that? A logo. Ugh. <laughs> we got a couple of designs for t shirts. You know what we need for those? A logo. Yep. 
And again, if this doesn't pan out, we're still probably going to continue to record mm-hmm. it. I don't know that we'll continue YouTubing it, but yeah. we enjoy this. It's fun. We enjoy listening to our banter. Yeah, we giggle like idiots when we have to listen, like idiots listen back over when them. When we listen back over them. So we crack ourselves up at least. We sure do. Mm-hmm. It reminds me how much I love you. Yeah. Let's see. Who do we have? We, we have, have the Grumposaurus Rex. Hey. There was a gizzard. I don't know if she's I think still she just here. went that way. So these were sh- yeah, I don't know. She's missing in action. Mm. But yeah, so those are the those are the plans. Those are the big announcements. The we big just announcements. Get out, get out there right out the gate. So after you hear this podcast, this will be the last one for about a month. About a month. Keep an eye out. But if you follow the link to YouTube, you may happen to see some short or something up there within that month if we're yeah. just like mm-hmm. testing something out. Absolutely. So might be teasers. Maybe teasers. Trailers. Trailers. Kitties. Kitties. I was going to say lots of small videos of kitties. And she has picked up the Instagram a little bit. I'm trying. She's been trying to keep up with putting out whenever there's new stuff. I definitely will. Stuff. So yeah. For real, really stick with it. We're terrible at social media. I, We're I'm, so bad I at it. I really don't like it, but. We open it and go, oh, and then close it yeah. again. Yeah. And I have well, a tendency I open it, to go, like ugh, and close it. You open it, go ugh, and uninstall it. Yeah, I uninstall it and then I reinstall it and then I delete it. Everybody I'm following, and then I get bored with it, so then I follow everybody again. And then five minutes later, I'm getting rid of them again. It's stupid. Mm-hmm. I just mm-hmm. hmm, social media. It's the best. And I keep thinking I should probably get on Facebook just so I can. Yeah. I, I no, mm-hmm. I'm not doing it to myself. Nope. I don't like it. I don't want it. I enjoy when people say, "Oh, you Facebook." Nope. Nope. And then they get so confused. And then they're like, wait, you don't have Facebook? I'm like, no. And it's amazing. And they're like, I've been thinking about doing that. I never never do. Mm -mm. I, yeah, I really don't like social media, but I'm really trying on the Instagram account. Even if I like, I'm trying to post stuff on my own personal one as well. Mm -hmm. It's not going great, but I'm trying. Look for pictures from my vacation. She is going to be going on vacation. She's leaving Friday right after work. Yeah, I'm three three more work days. Yep. Oh my gosh, I can't wait. And then I will be completely on my own for all of next week. You will be. Yep, yep, yep. yep. Well, you won't. You'll have three kitties to keep you company. That's not better. <laughs> That's not better. Yeah, so I am going to the Dominican Republic. Mm-hmm. It also so happens to be my 40th birthday the day after I get home. I'm getting home next Saturday late and my birthday is on Sunday so this is my big badass birthday trip I'm real excited really excited I've never gone outside of the country so for whatever reason I knew my goal was to go outside of the country within the last like couple of years Mm -hmm. so during COVID I got my passport and I was like after after COVID and everything opens up come hell or high water I am going on an international trip. You sure did. And lo and behold, I have some great friends that are like, hey, hey. We're going to this place to do this We're going to this thing. place to do this stuff. Do you want to come? And I'm like, yeah. yes. Did your boyfriend come with us? And I'm like, no. <laughs> I mean, I wanted you to come. I would have yeah, loved no, for you to right. come. You were absolutely invited to come along. You hate water. Yes. You don't like heights. Nope. So you hate heights, so you don't want to fly. You hate water, and I'm going to an island. Yes. Like, nothing about this sounds like... It'll be warm. And it's, it will be warm, but the sun is out and yeah, proud. Yeah. Out and proud. <laughs> out and proud. Oh. And you are a ginger and yeah. have to stay out of the sun, even though you love warmth. Yes. So everything about this trip is... All bad for me. All bad for you. Yep. So I'm going to be here working on podcast stuff. Yeah. So when I get back, he'll have everything figured out and ready to go. And she'll go, no, I don't like any of this. That's not true. This is all dumb. I'll probably go, sure. This is all dumb and stupid, just like your face is what she's going to say. I do not talk to you like that. And then she's going to punch me and punch Gizzard. Just Gizzard? Yeah. Oh, okay. Because she's your cat, so Mm -hmm. she gets punches too. Yep. Is that why when, when I upset you pusser gets mm-hmm. flicked mm-hmm. maybe you behave oh mm. oh oh really now yep so one thing we did realize as we were talking about transitioning to video is we're not going to be as edited no. as we were previously no because it's going to be hard right now we're doing multi-track and i can do a lot of like funking around with the different tracks and stuff and abridge everything so yeah. but i think i'm getting better with the microphone i think it'll be a good thing though because it'll kind of like i started getting a little little aggressive with some of the editing you did so i think this might take it back into more of the cozy space we were going for in the first and i think it's going to be a little little bit trial and error. it's going to be a little bit of trial and error i'm sure 
it's going to be a little frustrating. There's going to be a lot of like downtime and um, the uh, but yeah. we'll get there eventually. We'll get some of that out. But. but when there's quiet, they'll at least be able to see us making faces at each other and doing things like that that we have a tendency to do. Or talking to your brother on or the phone. Or you talking to my brother on your phone or you know, me talking with my hands. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. there's... There's mm-hmm. going to be a lot of like little things that we do that people ups will... and downs. Yeah, yeah, but swings and roundabouts. I think it'll be fun. I'm and excited. We already planned where we're going to be recording it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We'll leave that mm-hmm. up for for debate. No, not for debate, oh. but for a surprise. They can debate it. You can debate it. Mm. Where do you think we're recording it? Yeah. Our... Where do you think they're going to go? We're not recording it in the Dominican because he's not coming. Nope. But we but do have a vacation lined up. In September. October. October. And we'll we to, may just may. bring the recording stuff and record the podcast there. That's going to be a lot of stuff if we're doing a video then. Well, we can just record we'll it off of the phone. have to do a supplemental podcast. We'll just be like, waka, waka, waka. Oh, I didn't think about doing it like that. You know what's unfortunate? What? When we moved to video, mm-hmm. first of all, I'm going to apologize because I'm not dressing up for the video. Like, I am not even going to try to make this look good because it doesn't happen. I will, however. Yeah, but... I bought three new suits. I will have to wear bras then. Me too. That's unfortunate. I gotta strap those puppies in. You do have to strap those puppies in. (laughs) That's kind of unfortunate. Yeah. Well, I didn't think this through. No, we didn't at all. Dang it. <laughs> we have an upside down sleeping pussy cat. Mm-hmm. He's tired from all of his annoying you for the day. Mm-hmm. I'm sure he's not done. I'm sure this is just a reprieve to build up some energy for the... The night is young and he's so horrible. Mm, kitties. <laughs> What was hey, that? that was a gizzard. Was that a gizzard? I don't know. I don't, Did you hear it? Not really. Hey, where are you? Behind you. Eating the carpet like she do. Plump. Hi. That's that's the plan. What a little jerk. What up? She's showing me the belly. She sure is. I want to pet the belly. You sh- probably should. But I will get a dad. You probably will. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, oh, she's been captured. <clears throat> Say hello. Come on, Giz Giz. You're so pretty. Hello. Meow. Nope. Ow, ow, ow. She's a sharp go one. Scratch. Yes. She scratches me and I apologize. Mm-hmm. How is that fair? I don't know. I was streaming earlier and Fingen just kept coming up, putting his paws like up on the arm of the chair. Can they see him? He bit me at one point. Like, yeah, he the, does that when he wants attention. Yeah, his like, cute little love like bite. Doing the thing, he's like doing things like, what are you doing? Because he just wants to let you know he was there and he wanted and attention. And I picked really him up and was like, oh. Ah. He's like, no, no. <laughs> he's like, this is not why I bit you. This is not what I was after at all. No. He doesn't really know why he does it. It's really cute when he bites, though, because he doesn't bite hard and he doesn't do it mm-hmm. mean at all. It's just like a, hey, I'm here. Yeah. Hi, how you doing? But it was really annoying because they started at like three. I was like, you mm. two have like an hour to go. I don't know what you're... They've been starting real early. They've been starting to hmm. harass me at like 2.30, 3 o'clock for like the past week and a half. I don't know. Driving me nuts. Had it up to here. Wow, we. Mm-hmm. All I can think of is Finnegan biting your arm. And it's like, that would surprise you and be like, a oh, try peeing. Well, you stand up to pee, but try peeing and have him bite the top of your foot and you not expect it. <laughs> it's it's That kind of, would catch you off it, guard. It, yeah, it's very concerning. Yeah. And now he has a new thing where he, so we feed him in the bathroom. I'm sure we've talked about this multiple mm-hmm. times. The feeding arrangements. But now he does this thing where he decides he's taking a break from eating. And if I'm not giving him enough attention because I'm, you know, doing whatever... He jumps up on the back of the toilet and lays down and then just looks at me. And then he'll walk across the toilet and walk over the sink and sit on the edge of the sink and look at me. And then he walks back across and lays on the toilet again. And then he jumps down and then he goes and has a couple nuggets of food. And then he comes back over and he bites my foot. And then he jumps back up on the toilet and he just goes back and forth and back and forth. And he just doesn't know what he wants to do. He's very bad. We got two cleaners, though. He's very silly. There's a lot of of cleaning going on right now. There's a lot of cleaning going on. Pusser's yeah. cleaning his dirty, dirty, dirty They're face. They're both cleaning dirty, dirty faces. Oh, yeah. She's cleaning her dirty, dirty yep. face, too. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, where's Finny Poo Poo? Probably in the catio. He's oh, not. Oh, no, the, the catio closed. closed because Bubs is yeah. a jerk. So last week, after recording, I was going upstairs and tweaked my back. Yeah. Yep. And I have been down yep. pretty much all week. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. So the first time you hurt your back. The first time I hurt my back was the Friday prior. And you were making the bed. I was making the bed. Yeah. And I tweaked it just a little bit. I was like, ooh, ooh. And I just kind of like took it easy that day. And then Saturday, it was like, all right, it was a little annoying. I was like, eh, a little 
little sore. And then Sunday morning, I was like feeling all right. And then we got done with recording and we started going upstairs and walking up the steps from the basement to the first floor. I, it, I was walking up the steps and just tweaked my back in like two or three days of just agony. Yeah, it, it was. You've been stupid so dumb you've been very uncomfortable yes and then today yesterday and today have been the first days where it really didn't hurt and then i tried getting behind the drum set for a little bit earlier today and i made it about 20 minutes before my back started being a little sore and then i was like okay i'm gonna stop so i don't screw it up again so proud of you yeah, me too actually being in, no like and i mm. it sounds kind of like i'm being condescending but i'm not like i'm, I'm usually, genuinely proud of you I'll because normally you just through push through shit. it and then yeah. you'd end up hurting yourself a lot mm -hmm. more and you actually were smart and were like wait I should stop this. I now. should stop this now mm -hmm. before it hurts. That's what I did. I'm so proud of you. And then this past weekend, Sunday, 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 <laughs> we had a birthday and Father's Day extravaganza. We sure did. It was me and her and her parents and stupid Becca. Mm -hmm. And we had grilled yumminess. I grilled all of the yumminess. Yes. I sure did. I turned on the grill. You did. And you turned the grill off for me, mm -hmm, I believe. Mm -hmm, well, mm -hmm. you turned the gas off on the grill. Yep, yep. So none of this would have been possible. None of this would have been without possible without. And you also mm -hmm. uncovered the grill and covered it back up when we were done with it. I also ate a significant amount of the food. You sure did. But yes, we had burgers and dogs and kielbasa on the grill and mm -hmm. there was... And I made pasta salad. Pasta salad. And I made Mexican street corn. Yes. And the parents brought an ice cream cake. Which you have to remember that we have because it's huge and we have like half mm -hmm. of an ice cream cake. So I expect that to be gone when I come home okay. from vacation. Okay. He will not have touched it. I've totally forgotten about it. I'm going to have to like take a picture of it before I leave and every day send you a picture of it. Are we still talking about the ice that's, cream cake? Yes. Oh. That's a good use for the international plan I'm going to yes. get on my phone just to send you a picture of yes. the ice cream cake. Yeah, so the cookout was very nice. It was very nice. Mama made you new, pants. new cozy pants. <laughs> Excited for those. And she made me a purse mm -hmm. out of jeans. It's really, really pretty. I love it. I've gotten several compliments on it. It's beautiful. And she also made me like a little koozie for one of the cups that mm -hmm. I have. Mm -hmm. And it was so nice. Like I took it into work today and two of the people that I work with saw it and were like, oh my goodness, that's so cute. Is that how made? It's like made exactly for that cup. I said, it sure is. My mama made it for me for my birthday. And, and don't like, call her a hoe. Homemade? Oh, no, honey. Oh. Home. Made. Oh. Not homemade. Oh. And oh. don't call my mama a hoe. I better go in and double check and make sure they know yeah. that mama's not a you hoe. Guys, you guys realize it is homemade, and I'm not saying that the hoe that made it is my mama, right? Sorry, mama. She's probably giggling because you said it. <laughs> Anyways. Mama has this thing that when he and I have fake fights. She has this thing where she thinks I'm hilarious because she is correct. <laughs> Great. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Mama. I was down for the count most of the week, so I didn't get much accomplished. Yeah, I cooked a lot of food. We ate a lot of food. Mm -hmm. There's still some food that needs to be eaten. There's at. still some food that needs to be eaten. I'm going to be making quite a bit of food for you while I'm yes. gone on vacation, so you I have meals. I am spoiled. You are. I'm so very spoiled. Whoop. There was a thump upstairs. There was a thump upstairs. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm making you some food for when I'm gone. You'll have several days worth of food. Yay. And then... Order some pizza to supplement the other foods. Mm -hmm. And then you should be good to go. And then I'll be home. Yep. And then I'll have to go grocery shopping and figure out food for the week I get home. Yay. Yay. Um, There's no Finnegan down here. Finnegan is upstairs doing Finnegan things. Yep. Which is There's never a little a good thing. gizzard hiding behind the base. Yes. She's not hiding behind the little table. No, she's hiding now behind, it's behind the base. The base. Yep. Yep. You can see her bottom. <gasps> That's quite the bottom. It's a very small bottom. Yes. Mm. And then there's a pusser. Looking real grumpy. Looking very grumpy with a very large bottom. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You take after your mom. He's hiding behind his own bottom. He's hiding behind his own bottom. He's grumpy because he ate all his food and then barfed up all his food. Sorry, Theron. <sighs> He's the worst. And then went running around trying to lick all the cobwebs he could find. Which then make him sick. Yes. Yeah. It's a never-ending cycle for the poor dum-dum. Yep, yep, yep. So he's We grumpy. took him to the vet. They didn't find anything. Nope. So. Yeah, I don't know. It's strange. Yep. He's just a old grumpy man. Yep, yep, yep. That likes to eat his cobwebs, no matter. That likes to eat cobwebs he, he and likes to eat, leaves. He likes to eat strange things that make him sick. Yeah. I'm... Cobwebs, leaves, grass. Yeah. He, he, yeah. he gets a hold of any Flowers, of them. if I have flowers. Yeah. 
there's yeah. anything that he should not be eating, and they're it, delicious to him. And it, it makes him sick every, every time. single time. You'd think he'd learn. He'd, nope, nope. Nope. I've given up on him learning at this point. Yeah. Let's just keep him away from it all. Uh -huh. so yeah, kitties are the... Kitties are the worst. Talking with kitties, bitching, bitching about kitties. Bitching about kitties, yeah. Bitching yep, about yep. kitties today. We don't have a whole mm. lot to talk about today. No. So I was doing my stream because we're, we're recording this on a Tuesday evening just mm -hmm. because of the truncated timeline with her going on vacation, leaving Friday. So we wanted to get this out and get this ready to go. Yeah, I don't want to have to record the day I get back. Yeah. So we're getting this out of the way on a Tuesday. So Tuesday afternoons are one of my streaming days. So I was streaming and usually at four o'clock, I was like, hey, hold on. I'm going to go feed the kitties. And I go feed kitties. But for some reason today, I was like, you know what? I'm going to end it here. And it was a good thing I did because... Three or don't listen to this part. I came downstairs, fed kitties, went over, started emptying the dishwasher. I was about halfway done emptying the dishwasher. I heard Bubs barfing in the front room. And then I finished up emptying the dishwasher and heard him barfing some more because he never barfs once. No, he never. He barfs once, moves a couple feet away. Yep. And then barfs again. He sure does. Every single time. It's busy. Every been his single time. MO since we've had him. Since the entire time. So, finished putting away the dishes, grabbed some paper towels, grabbed a bag, went in, cleaned up the bub's barf, walk out, throw it away, see that he's out in the catio, in the corner, licking the wall. Go out, smack his bottom, chase him back inside, check his food dish, which still has food in it. Like, why are you licking the walls? Eat your food. Eat your food. No. And he wanders off. Since I had emptied the dishwasher, I had bottles for water. So I went over and started filling up the bottles with water. And then the big jug ran out of water. So I went into the closet, grabbed the spare, took it over, swapping them out, and heard Bubs barfing again. I went trucking over and carried him over in front of the front door because we have linoleum down there. So I carried him over there and just held him there so he'd barf there to make it clean up easier. Because it's place to, to barf, barf in the front room on the carpet. On the carpet. All the time. Mm -hmm. So I carried him over there. Got the first barf out, waited, got the second barf out. And this is just liquid. There's nothing left in there. Just liquid. And I went and cleaned it up, went over and looked. It's still food in his bowl. So I emptied his bowl because he was obviously more interested in cobwebs than he was his own mm -hmm. food. Let all the other kitties out. And after I let the other kitties out, I walk out. And there he is in the catio, in the corner, licking the wall again. So I chase him out of the catio again. Finish swapping the water out. Three or you can listen now. At this point, it's like... 20 till 5. Mm -hmm. This was 40 minutes of my life. Hmm. And the neighbor started mowing during all of this, too. So even if I would have been streaming, you would have heard a mower in the back. Yeah. And, uh, uh, kitties are the worst. Sounds like you had a day. It was the perfect ending to a perfect day. Oh. Just one of those days. I don't even know why. It's just one of those days. Hmm. Just meh. Yeah. Meh. Yesterday and today have kind of been like that for us. We've both well, just been kind of feeling out of it. Well, we didn't sleep for shit Sunday night. No, so that's why awful. yesterday was so bad. But yeah. I slept pretty good last night. I woke up. I was like, yeah. And then everything. Yeah. So... Yeah, eh, whatever. It happens, I guess. Onwards and upwards. That's right. So That's right. tomorrow starts all, well, no, today started a whole lot of packages rolling in from stuff that we ordered to for the new setup. Yep. I'm excited. And everything. Got to have to make a couple trips next week to pick up stuff while somebody's on vacation. Mm -hmm. But yeah, it's going to get real exciting real quick. And We're really, really, really excited really and excited. looking forward to it. And we yeah. really hope that everybody enjoys it because we're really looking forward yeah, we're really to looking it. we're looking forward to it. It's going to gonna be awesome it is i'm excited i am too super duper excited mm -hmm. mm. yay we just need to think of things to talk about mm -hmm. some days we can sit in front of the microphones oh, and we yeah. can talk no issues and have like an hour and a half and you look at me and you're like we should probably wrap this up because this is going to be a really long podcast yeah. so we stop talking yeah and then there's other days that we like i feel like we're talking forever and then i'm like okay what time are we at and you're like We've been talking for 15 minutes. Yeah. Like, oh, poopy doodle. Yep. 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 So we're going to have to think of something. It's almost always. So we try to keep the schedule on Sunday mornings because if we're in that mindset, it seems to work better. And mm -hmm. doing evening ones like this, it's always just kind of like. Kind of throws us off a little bit. Yeah. And we can never, never put the stuff together. And, you know, that's why we always, I wouldn't say we relied on Reddit, but we'd always use Reddit as a tool to get some conversation Because it would get us to start having conversations. Yeah, so, so we're going to need to come up with something, even. And that's why we like doing the, the game night with Would You Rather, because it could get it gets conversations actually, and debates yeah. and stuff going. So We do have a 
tendency to agree on a lot of things to begin with. But so, we still discuss it. But we can still then. discuss it. Yeah. And, you know, coming up with topics to discuss on the fly or even just randomly, it's harder than if you have yeah, something to spur, something the, conversation. To spur the conversation. Sometimes so, we're good. Sometimes we just ramble and ramble and ramble and we're good. Other times it's just... Other times we just need a little push. A little, a little, little push. nudge. Yeah. A little nudgy nudge. A little nudgy nudge. A little pushy push. A little pushy nudge. A little pushy nudge. A little nudgy push. A yeah. little nudgy push. Little nudgy push. The bass no longer has a butt. No, 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 no. It went that way, I think. Mm. So yeah, we're just gonna end this really early. We're gonna end this really early, and it's, it's primarily not... just to to say, hey, you know, we're gonna we're gonna wrap this up for the first season that we just figured out was a season. Yeah. And. Uh, <laughs> Kind of let you know what we got in the works and what you can be expecting in the future. We're really excited. We hope you are too. I'm sure. I'm sure the first one from season two is going to be a whole lot of talking about the Dominican. Yep. A whole mm-hmm. lot of talking about mm-hmm. the new setup and mm-hmm. everything. Mm-hmm. We'll, we'll make it up to you. Promise. And we'll make sure we talk about a whole lot of kitties. A whole lot of kitties. Yep. So we will. We will totally make it up to you. Yes. In the next episode after the last one. This is the last one. Yep. Why? Why do you have to make it so difficult? Why can't you just be like in our next episode? After the after the last one. This is the last one. Yes. So the next episode will be the first. Mm. <laughs> you are so ridiculous. <laughs> yes. <sighs> are you guys excited for round two? <laughs> Woo! <laughs> I might not come home from the Dominican. But okie dokie, keep an eye out on Instagram for sure. Uh, I'm going to try to put a link to the YouTube down below so you can find it and like and subscribe. Hey. Yeah, we're not going to be those people. Oh, yes, we are. Oh, we're going to be those people. So get excited for that. Yeah. And uh, tell us what you want us to talk about. Yeah. What shall we debate? No guarantee that we're going to, but you can no. offer suggestions and we will Absolutely. take them. We will take them. And do with them what we want. Yes. So thank you. And we'll see you soon. Bye.